What's up my people? Welcome back to J6 Flips. Today I'm headed to Granada Hills for Hope of the Valley Thrift Store. Um, the place is pretty big. They always have some cool items and the price is right. So uh, let's see if we find something good. Oh, 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 oh. Had something similar, but it was used. Let's see how this scans. Nothing. Here's my posting at the top. Found this thing over there. A couple sell for like 20. Alright, so this bin is where I found this helicopter. Uh, found a bunch of comps for over a hundred for a bigger version. More of a figure. This thing is actually flies. It's one of those string pull ones. Original boxing, obviously pretty beat up. It's at displaced from the original placement, but two bucks from 1984. Pretty cool. It's gotta be worth something.
I love this little hat rack. Got some cool ones. And this is the place I found a Beretta a shooting vest that already sold. I'll put those comps up. With tags. Three bucks. Oh yeah, this is a grab for sure. All right, so I made out like a bandit in there. I think here are the four bags I got, just random little knickknacks. The Beretta hat's probably gonna be my biggest profit. Um, but I'm excited to really look through it, do my real research, and um, list them and then get them sold. Thanks again, Hope of the Valley. Alright, so I'm headed home from Hope of the Valley. Pretty thrilled with how things went. Um, I told my wife I wouldn't bring a lot of stuff home, but when the picking's good, you pick. So I, I ended up with four bags of stuff, which had all turned into nice solid flips. Um, some of them more lucrative than the other ones, but uh, we'll go over those in a second. Um, but I wanted to say, I, I do like going to Hope of the Valley because they're a rescue mission here in the San Fernando Valley. Uh, they help a lot of people, and even in the, in the shop, they have uh, folks with special needs who come in and just kind of do community integration where they hang around. And I think they help out, organize some of the racks too, so they just get a chance to hang out. Um, and just if my way of supporting them is by thrifting and picking my goods there, then I'd, I'd much rather do that than uh, give my money to like a Goodwill or some kind of juggernaut. So. Um, yeah, Hope of the Valley, always nice, always clean, so um, I definitely go there pretty often. Okay, so just to recap real quick on what I got in the store and what I left behind. Uh, mind you, at Hope of the Valley on Tuesdays and Thursdays in the mornings until I think 2 is 25% off of everything. So all the tags on here are going to be 25% off of that price. These little guys are 2 bucks a pop, so yeah, you know, 3 bucks for both of them. This Beretta hat was... I believe three bucks so 25% off of that a little R2D2 French press the St. Jude medical Merlin at home transmitter three bucks a one hour charger for craftsman tools this is a nebulizer so I just got a notice on one of my other posts that I had. I had a similar, exact same one. Uh, not the exact same one, but a similar one. Same, a nebulizer that was taken down because it's a medical uh, device. So that's going to have to go somewhere else on Facebook Marketplace probably since it's brand new. Um, but either way, $10.99, 25% off of that. I can definitely flip that for some profit. Here's that wooden owl puzzle. Uh, the Blue Thunder helicopter thing. I'm gonna have to really do some research for that and see what the difference is. Obviously, this is a lot smaller than the ones that are selling for hundreds of dollars, but I'll take anything. I mean, it's gonna definitely be profit when it's only cost me two bucks. So what, one fifty for that? Uh, this Dynasty jacket. I had some, seen some nice comps, but I didn't see a lot of them. So maybe they're rare. Maybe they're hard to find. Hopefully, and uh, that'll definitely ra raise the price up. At seven bucks, 20% off of that, obviously. Cuddle duds, um, it's just super soft hoodie. I sold one, a woman's one before. I think this is a men's, it's just a lot bigger, or maybe it's just a larger size, but $4.99, take that for sure. And then I went to, oh, and these are the Guinness uh, pint glasses, but I just left them wrapped up. Four bucks for these molds. Um, they're popular with candle makers or wax melt people, so. At four bucks for the two of them, some were selling at like ten bucks for just one, so I think I can get a nice return on that. First time I've bought these, I've seen other resellers uh, get them, so why not get in on that? And then this thing is a little veggie spaghetti thing you put in like zucchini and twist. Five bucks, it's an as seen on TV thing, so it's not going to be probably a lot of profit, um, but I might end up keeping it as well. So um, yeah, we'll see how that goes. Oh.